Hello, my name is Franz and today I'm going to show you the new user management feature of the Diamond Film Restoration version 13. First, you have to start the Diamond Film Configuration Manager. In there, you are able to turn on the user management. Please select um, the icon Users and you will see here um, a button Enable User Management. So let's do this. I already have created some user, but when you started the first time, um, only the administrator user is there. So first thing is you should uh, give this or reset the password for the administrator. Then you can continue to add users as you wish. Let's add one and you can give it a password and confirm the password. So you have created a new user. So you can create any number of users you need for your organization. It is highly recommended that you lock the configuration manager when you're using user management. This will uh, protect the user accounts. When, it, when you lock it, uh, you give a password, a master password, to the configuration manager. Oh. Okay, so you see now here a lock on this. So we save the configuration and start the diamond. First thing it will ask me now when I start the project manager um, to log me in. I will first start as administrator since only the administrator can create new top level folders. Here you notice that there are already some folders which I created earlier. Um, when there is a green bar on it, it means this uh, folder is under user management and I have access to it. As administrator, I have always access. Here we have a folder which doesn't have any user management so everybody can change files in there. So let's create a new bin over here and let's create one for my new user. As you can see, it doesn't have any sign here. It means it's still not under user management. So I right click on it and say manage user access. Here I have a list of my users and now I can grant access to various users to these folders. Let's say these two users are allowed to work on Joe. Now I have done my assignments to the top level folders. I will change the user and let's change to Franz. As you can see now, the folder Paul has become a red and it's disabled since I don't have any access to this folder. I do have access to the folders France and Joe. In here I can now work as I was used to work in Diamond uh, without user management. Also note, please note, if you have user management turned on, some features like shortcuts and so on are different now for each user. So uh, this is another advantage using user management. I hope this quick tutorial uh, did show you how to use the user management in Diamond. Thank you.